this recording on cloud go. go hello everyone and welcome to the council trailer reaction edition today will we tonight we will be reacting to both trailers of in the heights there are two versions there is a powerful version and there is a washington heights version everyone welcome to washington heights let's go okay come on three two one Okay. Hurry up. Wait, no, no, not three, two, one. Hold up. I know. <laughs> oh, your roll. Hurry up. <laughs> um, just so everyone's clear, we're gonna react to the powerful one first. So everybody okay. have okay. Have and yeah, walk. We have a lot of us in this room today. Wow, Anthony, Jack, Liam, Constance, and Ben. Um, so this is exciting. Okay, three, two, one, play. Let me just listen to blah blah blah. Oh, that's nice. Nice. It's quiet. Usually the one train's up there screeching. Someone has an echo oh, so and it's stuff. really annoying me. <laughs> it's got me thinking about all the people I care about the most. There's I like a breeze off the Hudson. And just when you think you're sick of living here, the memory floods in. The morning light off the fire escapes. The nights in Ben the Park blasting big pun tapes. It's a story of a block that was disappearing once upon a time. Far away land called Washington Heights. Washington Heights. Notice Heights. we're going. Say, so it doesn't disappear. Washington Heights. I love Anthony oh, Ramos. Bad changes happening on the block since you've been at school. When it came to dreams, we had to keep scraping by. Ice cold beat agua. It's only when we get into these crazy hypotheticals. You really want some bread? Then go ahead, create a set of goals. Pick a business school and pay the entrance fee. And maybe if you're lucky, you'll stay friends with me. <laughs> they used to say, you work hard, you live by the rules, the things will come. And those things will no, come. Oh, I love the abuelita. I'm going to give you some fairy tale. Ignore anyone who doubts you. Because this place, this is it. Ah, uh, look at the colors. Uh, so, I just want to see all the Nice. Wow. This is good. Wow. Yeah. I mean, I'm going to watch it regardless, but this does look great. Yes, I think we're Whoa. <laughs> Remember Fools? Oh, yeah. you can see a future. Sonny, you're late. You know you love me? Oh, that's cool. Oh, that looks great. That looks so good. Okay. That looks really good. Yeah. Uh, thoughts. Let's go to let's go to Anthony first, since you're like the musical theater guy. <laughs> Along with Constance, um, yeah, I, I, this looks fantastic. I think this is shaping up to probably be the best thing John M. Shu has ever done. Um, I I'm saying much. Well, it's crazy. Yeah. <laughs> um, but I enjoyed Crazy Rich Asians. Um, yeah. But this makes me very optimistic about the Wicked movie because it looks like he knows how to direct a musical. I think that's the main takeaway that the, the dances are very colorful and very lively, but also, and there's so much happening, but it's also very focused and it looks like a lot of fun. This looks like a big summer movie. And whether you watch it at HBO Max or in theaters, I think it'll be a fun mm -hmm. one. It looks, it has yeah. a lot of integrity, it looks like. So yeah, I love it. It does. Well, you know, there's another trailer because Warner Brothers likes to do things incorrectly. <laughs> so let's uh, let's react to that one first and then we can share everyone else's thoughts. So this one's called Washington Heights because, you know, they don't want us to. They, they want metadata to be hell for us, which is fun. That's fine. Um, this, let me know when everybody has it. Yeah, yeah I'm ready. Have it. Also, sorry, somebody had an echo and it annoyed me so who was that do, they, do we know show yourself no okay it's fine it'll be it'll be okay uh three two one play <gasps> once upon a time what a bitch 
I like this one a lot more already. Yeah. Too, yeah. So it doesn't disappear. Washington Heights. Lights up from Washington Oh, I love that. Oh, that's cool. I got this little punk. I got to chase you with. Pop the grape at the crack of dawn. Sing while I wipe down the awning. Hey, y'all. Good morning. Ice cold feet out like cherry, strawberry, and just for today. Damn it, Lynn Manuel Miranda. Hey, he's got to be doing something. The block that was disappearing. The genius is back. Yo, the water budget in this film right is huge. Hey. There's something on your shirt. <laughs> Smooth operator on them. <laughs> we all had a sueñito. And when it came to dreams, we had to keep scraping by. Maybe this label oh. is changing forever. <laughs> Maybe tonight is our last night together, however. I just want to see the whole world through our eyes. They're talking about kicking out all the dreamers. It's time to make some noise. We had to assert our dignity in small ways. Little details that tell the world we are not invisible. I love her so much. This is the moment when you do better than me. Because you can see a future that I can't. But we go, we wrap up people, let it be go! You made all of this? This is me. <laughs> they used to say, you work hard, you live by the rules, the money will come, the things will come. You ready? I've been saving up all my pennies in my piggy bank this day. Today's all we got, so we cannot stop. This is a block. In the heights, I'm hanging the flag on this bed. Cheers. It reminds me that I am in the miles of the This is crazy. <laughs> <laughs> Best days of my life. And I built my little dream, my sueñito. Washington Heights. Yeah. Oh, that was a man. lot better. Yeah. yeah, that was way better. Only in theaters. What? Uh, no. Discover at Adobe Cinema. <laughs> oh, this is the UK and Ireland trailer. I'm sure, yeah. Never mind. Yeah, so UK and Ireland. I'll see you in yeah, cinema. Yeah. Uh, Constance, what do you think? Seeing it in the cinema. You know, in a post-vaccine world, this is exactly the movie we need. It's bright, it's colorful, it's happy. It's like after a year of being locked away in our houses and stuff, it's it's like, yeah, remember pools, remember party, remember yeah. just being with people. <laughs> like I, I think this is like the the real vaccine that we need. Like, let's get back to life and it's so full of flavor and it's so colorful. Yeah, yeah. this is the movie we need. <laughs> yeah. I agree with that 100%. Like, musicals are always super fun, especially in a theater, because, like, Greatest Showman and Mamma Mia and all those, like, it's Horrible. such a... Shut up. Uh, it's such Mia a, like, fun stuff. experience, and I love Mamma Mia too. Shut your mouth. I like it's one of the worst movies I've ever seen. I'm sorry. Oh one of the worst films I've ever seen. So I really like this trailer. <laughs> yeah, trailer so back to this movie. I agree with Constance. I think this is, like, going to be... I think it's going to be big because people are going to like want to go out and have fun. And I, I think it is exactly what we need. Uh, ben, since you had so much to say, why don't you go next? Sorry, it's just that Mamma Mia 2 is one of the worst movies I've ever seen. And I hate the great show. But this looked really cool. That's Rebecca I, Ferguson. <laughs> yeah, and still a bad movie. Okay, whatever. Uh, you can't love things blindly, people. But, you know, I think in the heights... I, I kind of had fantasies of like seeing the movie over like summer 2020 when I first saw the trailer and then like going for pizza or something afterwards. Like it just seemed like such a fun summer time and then it never happened. But now it's, it feels like it's going to happen this time and I'm really excited for it. It seems like a really lively movie. Yeah. Such a shame that and... Lima Miranda's in it. <laughs> he's, yeah. he's the but piragua he, he guy. He's gonna... He did yeah, create he did. it. I know. He created it, um, and he's the piragua guy, and he doesn't get that much, but he's good as a piragua. It's, fun. it's yeah. a fun little cameo for him. I really yeah. want to watch it. I'm so and, excited. I wrote a paper okay, yeah, on nah, this. I love it. I love it. I, yeah, I wrote you're a paper singing on along. This. Yeah, I. It's still in there <laughs> somewhere. Um, yeah, I love this musical a lot. Um, it's great. It's aggressively Latin, as it should be. And, you yes. know, as a Latina, this is great. I love it. I'm ready. I want to watch it. 
Um, I never got to experience In the Heights as like a theatrical production. So this is great because I'm finally going to see it like this. And yeah, it's good. I'm going to tell my abuelita to watch it. Oh, yeah. Mm -hmm. And like to, to Ben's point, I think um, also the fact that, yeah, we couldn't do anything last summer. I think it's going to be so fun, even if you only watch this on HBO Max and like the world is still shit, you know, in June or July, whenever this comes out, like going on a Zoom and watching this with people, I think is going to be a lot of fun and living through uh, Anthony Ramos. Jack, what do you think? Uh, I thought it looked really well made, all the choreography and the cinematography and all that looked really good. Um, yeah, it does look like a perfect summer movie. And I'm happy for Anthony Ramos. I think he deserves a big lead role like this. Agreed. Yeah. Agreed. <laughs> yeah. And Liam, last but not least. I'm just, I am just so excited. It just, it looks like they're barfing up color, beautiful, scrumptious visuals alongside obviously an amazing soundtrack. And I cannot wait. Like, I am so excited. Ah, I already love musicals. <laughs> I love Lin Manuel Miranda, even though Ben hates him. I think he's amazing. I think doesn't get enough credit. I think for some reason everyone just hates him. He gives himself too much credit. <laughs> exactly. He wrote yeah. the whole thing. He's the writing to. is fine. He he did not need to be in Hamilton, and he did not need to be in he's this allowed one, to. and he did not need to be in Mary Poppins. He's allowed to, but he's not good. So like, it he just was brings so his bad projects down. He's, he's he not bad. He's, he's not just bad. haters. He isn't bad. <laughs> yes, he gets a little bit more than he should when it comes yeah. to on-screen roles, but look, look at how well written. Hamilton is. Look at how well written in the Heights is. Look at mm -hmm. the music for Moana. Like these are things that he does creatively, and they are fantastic. And people don't give him credit for these things because everyone's just get well. He's done me great, and I don't care. Blah. Like give the man some credit. He does. He does a good job. I agree. Yeah, that. He's a good writer, but. I don't think he's a very good actor. Sorry, Nat, you were gonna say something. Um, he has a good barba in the movie as the Pirawa, but I don't know how to say yeah. it in in a English. beard. Yeah. There we go. Bilingual problems. <laughs> no, um, I get that. Can I before we wrap up? I just want to say that mm -hmm. I f I feel very good watching this because I for I I I was horrified that Hollywood forgot how to make musicals with the Tom Hooper era that we just kind of hopefully came out of um so to see like the so to see like them dancing on the on the walls and then you mm. see like the little kid looking out at them dancing on the window like that type of things like that gives me hope that not only will this be a good movie but it'll be a good musical and it's like they know how to take it they know how seriously to take their material the emotions still hit but it tonally it it works and i i'm very i'm look after like all the Marvel stuff and like the big movies, like this is probably one of my most anticipated movies of the year. So I'm very excited. It's gonna kill West Side Story as it should. It's gonna murder. As well, it uh, yeah. A Star Is as Born should, should have killed Bohemian Rhapsody. Bohemian Rhapsody. Rhapsody yeah. yeah. So I'm not saying anything will happen. What should happen is a different conversation. Mm. Yeah. Well, um, yeah, that was our reaction to two trailers. We've been going for 19 minutes, so that's <laughs> fun. <laughs> Um, <laughs> thank you everybody for watching uh, if you like us we have a podcast if you don't like us we have a podcast um, you should check it out either way it's called The Council we have new episodes every Tuesday um, you can subscribe to this channel www.youtube.com slash the movie lover um, sub subscribe hit the bell like uh, we have a reaction video to the new Justice League trailer earlier today we're going to do a Cruella um, we're reacting to the Oscar nominations live tomorrow morning. Uh, so a lot of fun stuff. Follow us on Twitter also because we update that a lot. I'm not even going to bother plugging the other ones because we're not as active. But yep. Liam, I'm looking at you. What? <laughs> <I> try. <laughs> Why are you so I update. Mad? I update everything when you tell me to on Twitter, That's on true. Insta. Yeah. And All right. Bye-bye, bye, everyone. Okay. Bye. <laughs> bye. Yeah, bye. Get the job done. Ha <laughs> <laughs>
Oh hey, thanks for watching. And remember, full episodes are available wherever you get your podcasts. With new episodes Tuesday at 9 a.m. Pacific Standard Time, links in the description box. And be sure to subscribe and hit that bell to stay caught up to date with The Council. Boys, I'm excited.